Brothers and sisters of the Circle, today we welcome a new soul into our mortal fold. This woman has endured, has challenged, and has shown her valor. Who will speak for her? I stand witness to the courage of the soul before us. Would you raise your shield in her defense? I would stand at her back, that the world might never overtake us. And would you raise your sword in her honor? It stands ready to meet the blood of her foes. And would you raise a mug in her name? I would lead the Song of Triumph as our Mead Hall reveled in her stories. Then the judgment of this circle is complete. Her heart beats with fury and courage that have united the companions since the days of the distant green summers. Let it beat with ours, that the mountains may echo and our enemies may tremble at the call. It, it shall, shall be so. so. Kaiden, Well, girl, so? you're one of us now. <laughs> I trust you won't disappoint. Oh, you get... <laughs> I see you've been allowed to know some secrets before your appointed time. No matter. Yes, it's true. Not every companion, though. Only members of the Circle all share the blood of the beast. Some take to it more than others. Well, I grow old. My mind turns towards the horizon, to Sovngarde. I worry that Shore won't call an animal to glory as he would a true Nord warrior. Living as beasts draws our souls closer to the Daedric Lord Hircine. Some may prefer an eternity in his hunting grounds, but I crave the fellowship of Sovngarde. Yes, but it's no easy matter. But you don't need to share the worries of an old warrior. This day is to rejoice in your bravery. And speak to Yorland if you want a better weapon than... whatever that is. Congratulations, my friend. Yay! Alright. Well, it would appear so. Oh, what the fuck? I'm going to need you to do something drastic to get that image out of my head. Can we stop for an eel? <laughs> 